Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 11.08 a.m. on Monday, April 4th of 2022. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing another flavor of these new Super Coffee drinks. Um, I got this um, on a Wednesday last week, so almost a week ago now, but um, yeah, this one sounds like an interesting flavor. We shall see, though, how it tastes. But um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the new Caramel Waffle Super Coffee Coffee Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that bottle. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And it has a white top lid. It has a yellow and a white design bottle. And it has a green on it, too. Around the top it says caramel waffle, naturally flavored with other natural flavors, plant-based enhanced coffee. Peel or twist open. It says the same thing on the other sides. Super coffee, positive energy. Plant-based, zero grams added sugars, 10 grams plant protein, 200 milligrams caffeine. So, oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit. It will get you lit, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, it's pretty strong, you know, just saying. Shows the waffles and it's like, has like caramel dripping down them. Um, probably would have been better if it was just like maple waffles, but um, caramel waffles sounds pretty cool though too. You know, it looks like maple syrup though, see what I mean? Um, but yeah. 80 calories per bottle, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. Caramel waffle, naturally flavored with other natural flavors, no artificial sweeteners. Has the SKU and some other codes and stuff. Best Buy, December 14th, 2022. Drinksupercoffee.com has Instagram, Pinterest, uh, TikTok and Facebook logos at Drink Super Coffee. Scan for more at Super and it probably takes you to their website and it's a QR code. So, yeah. Super Coffee, it all started in our little brother's dorm room. When we reimagined coffee and replaced the negatives with positives like protein, MCT oil, and no sugar natural sweetener, Super Coffee was born. And with it came an eternal source of positive energy. When you reimagine your coffee experience from Super Coffee to Super Creamer, and everything in between, you'll tap into that same source of super to sustain you all day long. Ready, let's go. Choose positive energy. Jordan, Jake, and Jimmy. Zero grams added sugars. 10 grams plant protein. MCT oil. 200 milligrams caffeine equals two cups of coffee. So, yeah. Top of the bottom is like nothing and stuff. Anyway, nutrition facts, it says one bottle, 12 fluid ounces, amount per certain calories, 80. Total fat, 3.5 grams, 4%. Saturated fat, 2.5 grams, 13%. Trans fat, 0 grams. Cholesterol, 0 milligrams, 0%. Sodium, 110 milligrams, 5%. Total carbohydrates, 3 grams, 1%. Dietary fiber, 1 gram, 4%. Total sugars, less than 1 gram. Includes 0 grams added sugar, 0%. Protein, 10 grams, 20%. Vitamin D, 0 micrograms, 0%, calcium, 216 milligrams, 15%, iron, 3 milligrams, 15%, potassium, 500 milligrams, 10%. And then it has other ingredients, Colombian coffee, pea protein, natural flavor, MCT oil, contains less than 0.5% of monk fruit juice concentrate, caffeine, gel and gum, stevia, calcium carbonate, sodium hexametaphosphate, uh, dipotassium phosphate, Ketu, distributed by Ketu Life Incorporated, Austin, Texas, 78745, keto, plant-based, it's dairy-free and gluten-free. So, yeah, it's not made with milk. See what I mean? But has a pea protein isolate. Um, That might make it taste a little bit weird. Some drinks with a pea protein taste weird. But you know what I mean? Um, but these super coffees, they don't really taste weird, though. They actually taste pretty good. See what I mean? Um, but yeah, I got this at Walmart. It was $3, so I guess it's okay priced. It could have been a little bit cheaper. You know, it's a coffee drink, though. See what I mean? Um, but, yeah, anyway, I'll let you see the bottle now right quick. This one sounds like it might be pretty interesting. We shall see. Caramel waffle. Um, but yeah, they released um, some breakfast flavors. They released, you know, the cinnamon roll one, which I reviewed in my last review. Then they released this one. And they released a blueberry muffin one. But um, I think that's pretty much similar to the one I reviewed before. The blueberry latte. It's, they probably just now called it blueberry muffin, though. It's probably the same flavor. But I don't know, though, because I haven't tried it. The new design version, see what I mean? 
Um, but yeah. Um, but I seen it at my Walmart a few days ago, but um, when I went back two days ago or whatever, they didn't have it, because I was going to buy it. But, um, yeah, so they don't have it anymore. Um, but if they do get it again, I'll get it. But after work today, I'm going to go back to my Walmart, and I'll see if they have it again. But um, they have another flavor, which I guess I didn't review before, is the caramel flavored one. I was going to get it today after work and then probably review it in my next review. So stay tuned for that review and my upcoming reviews. So yeah, there's the other ingredients. The distributor information and stuff in the rest of the bottle. Okay, that's pretty much the entire bottle, so I'm going to shake it up a little bit. Open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. I already took the picture of the bottle this morning um, before I went to work. I already got the picture ready to upload, so... I'm gonna try to open it without messing up the plastic too much. That's probably gonna happen. Inside the lid is nothing, but it has like an aluminum foil seal on it, so I have to take that off. So yeah, I'm gonna shake it up a little bit more though. Okay, I opened it. And the color, um, Basically the same as all the other super coffees, like a lightish brown color, but with my lighting right now, it's a little bit darker though. It might actually be a teeny bit darker than the one I reviewed yesterday. Um, the one I reviewed yesterday was definitely more like a lighter brown. This one's a little bit darker though. Even with the good lighting, you know, it's still a little bit darker, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, it had a little bit of froth in it. A little bit creamy, see what I mean? But anyway, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, this smells similar probably to the one I'm going to be reviewing tomorrow. Um, the original caramel one. I'm guessing anyway, because I haven't tried it yet. Um, but yeah, it definitely smells like caramel and coffee. Um, but... Hmm. Actually, it does have a little bit of like a waffle smell. Um, if you get like the Eggo waffles, you know. And you put some syrup on it. It smells just like that. Um, so, even though this doesn't say it's maple, it says it's caramel. Um, definitely smells like a, you know, maple syrup covered waffle, you know. But I guess it does have a little bit of caramel smell too, though. And yeah, mixed with the coffee, it actually smells pretty good. It definitely smells really lit, you know, just saying. So yeah, definitely caramel and waffle. So, I guess the name of the flavor is accurate, you know, just saying. See what I mean? Um, but yeah, it actually smells really delicious, but, um, this would probably be a good breakfast drink, you know, a good way to start your day. It has 200 milligrams caffeine, you know, probably go good with, like, waffles and French toast and pancakes and stuff, or donuts. You know, it's a waffle-flavored drink. Uh, still probably would go good with waffles, you know, just saying, see what I mean? Because you still get that coffee, um, taste and stuff and smell. Um, but yeah, it smells pretty good, but, um, anyway, now I'm going to try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I definitely like this one better than the one I reviewed yesterday. The one I reviewed yesterday was a little bit weird. It's cinnamon rolling, you know. It tasted like normal, a um, little bit like a an espresso type of flavor at first, but then in the aftertaste, it definitely tasted the cinnamon. That's when you get the caramel flavor all the way through the flavor, even before the aftertaste. You know what I mean? That's mixed in with the coffee, so you get a good mix of flavors, you know? And yeah, it does have a little bit of like a waffle flavor too. Um, yep, it just tastes like a, you know, a maple waffle, but um, I guess maybe with some caramel added to it, see what I mean? Um, so yeah, it's actually pretty good, see what I mean? It tastes really good, it has a cool ball design, energy wise or worse, it has 200 milligrams caffeine. It doesn't have any B vitamins though, but still, still get you lit, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And it has protein in it too, and it's plant based. Um, so I'd say energy wise, it lasts about 4 hours to 5 hours of energy, may work a little bit more, it's really strong, you know. Probably shouldn't drink and have any anxiety problems and stuff, but yeah, it's actually really delicious. A really good flavored coffee drink. It definitely tastes like how it says it does. You know, caramel and waffles. You know what I mean? It definitely tastes pretty lit. Um, 
But yeah, I got it for an okay price. It's $3 at Walmart. It's brand new. Could have been a little bit cheaper, but you know what I mean? It's still pretty good, though. Um, but yeah, definitely highly recommend trying it. It has a cool ball design. It tastes good. Energy wise, it works good. It's okay price. Could have been a little bit cheaper, but you know what I mean? So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely try it. It's really lit. I'm going to give the new Caramel Waffles Super Coffee positive energy, you know, coffee drink, you know. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely has a sweet um, caramel flavor. And the coffee is sweet too. Maybe a little bit dark. But when the coffee flavor mixes with the caramel flavor and a little bit of like the maple waffle flavor. Actually tastes pretty good, you know, just saying. So yeah, it's smooth. Even though it doesn't have any milk, it's creamy. So yeah, definitely try it. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah. Definitely try it if you can find it. It's brand new, really good. Definitely highly recommend it. give it a 10 out of 10. Anyway, my next review, I'm going to be reviewing the original Caramel Super Coffee Drink. So, for that review. This is from Mount Review. Some more videos. So, watching. See you guys later. Peace out. Well, I might actually review the Blueberry Muffin one if I find it today, too. Um, but anyway, just see more reviews. See more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.